Good afternoon, me again. More prezzies. <laughs> I've got to share. Um, this is from uh, Teresa, the lady in Scotland that I've been doing that swap five with that um, 49 Dragonfly started. And I've just opened this and I'm absolutely... Wow. <laughs> I'm blown away. <laughs> Teresa, thank you. I mean, look at this, guys. She said I put pink in because I think you're not a pink person. <laughs> <laughs> quite right but actually this is my kind of pink it's the real I don't know how to describe it yeah I don't know anyway I do like pink <laughs> but, oh, I mean you know I've got velvets I've got that is beautiful that feels like silk actually my hands are a bit rough I've just been gardening actually sorry if my nails are a bit dirty never thought to check that but um yeah absolutely stunning i'm blown away teresa if you're watching this thank you my darling i've got another one to share in a minute as well but i thought i've got to show you these oh gosh these are just beautiful that is um incredibly fine let me know if that's an Indian one. It looks like it might be, but I don't know. And beautiful threads, which is starting to come undone because they're rebels, this silk thread. I know I've got some. <laughs> kind of got mind of their own. That's clever. Wrapping it on the hexagon. I like that. Steal that. <laughs> and this, look at this. Isn't that beautiful? She said some of it's vintage and some of it's new. So... I would, I don't know actually, I think I would say that's new, but I could be wrong. I don't know. Teresa, let me know if you're in here. Just put me a nice comment in, but that is beautiful. I've got a good metre of each one. I mean, that stuff's not cheap. This is cute as well. I don't know if you can make out tiny little flowers. See, there's the leaves and there's the flower. That's going to be lovely. Lovely to play with. And this is nice as well. Look at this. I mean, it's simple, but it's beautiful. Oh, here we are. There's the right side. It's just gorgeous. Am I in screen? Yeah. I hope it's focusing. Sorry if it's not. The smallest zip in the world. <laughs> Never seen one so small. And all these beautiful threads. What a lovely way to display it. Well done, Teresa. I like that. I'm going to have to have a pink box, aren't I? That's a nice one. Oh, I might try that with a bit of tatting. That's really nice. It's got a proper sparkle on it. I don't know if you're getting the sparkle. That's lovely. In fact, I might try a lot of these with um, tatting. Gorgeous. Yeah, I haven't delved any further. I thought I've got to film this because you're going to want to see this. This is lovely. I don't know if you can um, make out. It's got the garden house printed on it. Isn't that lovely? I mean, how many ribbons are there in the world? I mean, there must be millions, I should imagine. Nice piece of thread. That'd be good for, well, for binding. I, well, I don't know. Anyway. Uh, yeah, she said some of the fabrics are vintage and some are new. So I'll just give you a quick. Oh, I've had that one. I know that's a new one, new if you know, not vintage basically. Oh, see, I love bits like this. I'm a sucker for a scrap. Beautiful. I've had similar to that, so I know that's a newish one. That's nice. That'd be nice to work on. Nice bit of seersucker. Like a bit of seersucker, got tiny little roses on. Oh, a doily. Well, a circle. Oh, blimey, that's pink. <laughs> Whoa. That's really pretty, actually. I like that. That's vintage. Pretty sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. That. That is me. Is that a Tula pink one? Because that really looks Tula pinkish to me. That is stunning. 
see I don't mind that's kind of a day glow pink it's like in your face I don't know it's the sugary stuff I'm not very keen on <sighs> organza I'm so spoiled <laughs> beautifully laid out as well well done that was the right side teeny tinies a nice bit of it's a really thick cotton actually that could be vintage i don't know what else have we got under here burying it see this is ideal strip piecing bit of strip quilting yeah i love bits like this are you seeing this yeah i think you are that kind of looks vintage, not sure. Could be new because they're bringing out so many new ones now that look vintage. It's a bit confusing to say the least. It's a nice one. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I love that. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, that's gorgeous. That is beautiful. Yeah, really pretty. Come on, don't peek. It's a lovely bit as well. I love paisleys. Isn't that beautiful with the pink, uh, with the green? Pink and green go together so well. I think they're on opposite sides of the colour wheel, aren't they? So, oh, that's a nice bit. It's a bit full. It's um like a needle, very fine cord draw. I don't know if you can get that. That is really a lovely, touchy feely. It's really nice. Oh, nice bit of batik. I do like a bit of batik. And another bit. This is very, oh gosh, that is pretty. Wow, Teresa, you've got some beautiful fabrics, mate. And now I have as well. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? So pretty. My taste in fabrics isn't that good. <laughs> See, I don't mind that. That's raspberry. I like that. I like a raspberry. That's lovely. What have we got here? It's a pocket that didn't work out. <laughs> it's very, very pale. Very pale roses. Gorgeous. What else have we got? got some big of it here. Lots of roses. Obviously, you like roses. I like roses. It's lovely. Look at that. I mean, that's what you call floral. <laughs> I love that. It's really nice. Oh, I can see. Um, I can see some projects being made out of these. That's lovely too. Yeah, obviously. Bit of dressmaking going on there. It's a big piece. That's really pretty. Wow, thank you. And to boot, I've got some nice tissue paper as well. Nice. Yeah, postman's literally just come, so uh, I thought I'm going to do it now. Oh, that is beautiful. Thank you, Teresa. I've got a lovely note with it as well, so um, let's put that the world's tiny and zip in there as well. Move that out of the way. Gorgeous. Thank you so much. And another one that's just arrived with the lovely postman is from the amazing Martha Managross. Martha, thank you, my darling. All the way from the States. This you see yeah this is martha's ice dyeing i hope she starts selling it because it's beautiful and look at this lovely card that's lovely that martha i love that really nice just three envelopes but beautifully done all the same images yeah gorgeous 
Okay, simple. Yeah, well, <laughs> it's not hard for me. <laughs> Dream, yeah. From small beginnings come great things. Is that a stamp, Martha? Isn't that lovely? Isn't that beautiful? Nice. Is that a pocket? No, it's not a pocket. No, okay. Gorgeous. That'll go on my washing line. I've got a washing line that I keep all these bits on. Right, now then. She's very kindly. Hope you like what I sent. Hugs. Martha. Martha, I love it. <laughs> all of it. Every single bit. Right, um, yeah, so this is her eye styling, which is... Oh, it's just... This is cheesecloth. I mean, handily, she's written... Let me get up closer for you. She's written on every single piece, thank goodness. <laughs> This I'd say is scratching my head otherwise. But this oh, this is beautiful, Martha. Oh she's oh right, okay. Wow. That is beautiful. Look at that colour. Nice with the yellow in the or green is it in the middle? Take that off. That's a very fine cheesecloth. Don't think we get it that fine here. I've got rough nails. Let me just, sorry, quick bit of quick manicure in the oven. It's a new garden. That is beautiful. That's really fine. I don't think I've ever seen it that fine. Beautiful. Gosh, I'm going to have fun with this. Like, I've got to get some projects going, haven't I? And there's another bit there as well. See, that's lovely. I love, you know, where it's sort of just does its thing oh look at that got peacock blue in there as well sorry about the lighting it's weird weather day today one minute it's beautiful sunshine and roasting hot and the next it's minging love that love where that transitions into that color let me get it on the white tissue and it might show up a bit better oh my nails are so rough catching there we are it's gorgeous look at that oh i'm so gonna have fun i love that peacock look at that oh oh martha if you're not selling this you must be mad right i'm gonna put that note back on there because i will forget what's what right that's that one what's this one Flower sack towel. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, Martha, but you said you get these, was it Walmart or one of your shops? And that is really nice, actually. That's a lovely weave in that fabric. Ah, focus, you freak. No, it's not going to. Um, yeah, that is gorgeous. Yeah, see, it just begs to be embroidered, doesn't it, and have things put on it. Yeah, and a piece of that sort of laid on and scrooched and mm. God, I'm supposed to be working I'm supposed to be doing stuff Martha not, not playing and planning <laughs> I was so easily influenced aren't I right what's this one muslin I do like a bit of muslin let's take the Aries off. See again, you got that lovely mix between the um, the purple and the green. It's gorgeous. Somehow brighter on that side. Okay. I did say to Martha, she needs to sell these because they're beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Size are they? Eleven and a half. Yeah, we discussed it, and I said to her, make them about sort of twelve inch, and and that'd be great. I mean, that's a nice size to work on that, because you know, if you're a journal maker, that could become a journal cover quite easily. Yeah, it's five, nearly six inches. I mean, it's too tall, if anything. So you'd have to, you can easily make pockets out of it and stuff like that, couldn't you? Yeah, and obviously do your embroidery work on top. 
Right, let's put that back on. Oh, sorry, I'll forget. Green, I love green. I know a lot of people don't, but I do. Quilting cotton, okay. I don't know how that's different to any other cotton. Is it? You'll have to enlighten me, I don't know. You guys have all sorts of lovely fabrics out there. We don't, unfortunately. Well, we probably do. I just don't know about them. Again, that's lovely. Love the colours. <sighs> lucky, lucky me. Is this, this must be the same because it was, uh, yeah, so that's quilting cotton. Oh, oh, oh. See, flower there. It's actually, it looks like a leaf coming there. Little rosy garden over here. Pond. <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's put that under there. And then, oh no, that's quilting cotton. Men's t shirt. I hope you haven't nicked your husband's t shirts. That's dyed really well, hasn't it? Cotton, obviously. I presume it's cotton. See again, sort of a garden. You could do almost like sky there. Garden flowers. Pond. <laughs> Got to think about ponds. That's beautiful. Wow. Thank you. Gosh. Trouble is right. This will go in the little the little special area, and I'll just sit there, and it'll have to be a very special project. And I shouldn't do that. We're really naughty for it, aren't we? We um, us crafters, we um, we hoard like crazy because we want it for that special project instead of blooming using it. So I'm going to make it a mission to actually use these. Oh my gosh, that is a super super fine cheesecloth I don't think I've ever seen it that fine before really lovely I love that that blue stunning <sighs> I'm so lucky <laughs> beautiful thank you and um, both of you absolutely stunning um, I'm feeling thoroughly spoiled this last week um, and it's not my birthday till the 13th <laughs> I'm feeling very happy. Thank you. Thank you both of you. Very kind. Um, I didn't get my make five. I don't know if I've sent you a swap, Teresa, so I don't know. But anyway, there we are. <sighs> Who's a lucky girl? That's it. You've been good. <laughs> Speak to you later. Bye.